Hey everyone, it's Steve here at the DJ Lab. Take a look at the Denon DJ SC Live 4 hooked up with brand new Serato 3.0 running the stems. And uh, I'm also showing off the brand new MacBook Pro 16 inch. This is the M1 Pro with one terabyte in it. Thanks to my mom, she was at the Apple store today. I was with her and she decided she wanted to buy a new laptop. But I'm like, hey man, go big or go home, go for it. You know what I mean? Buy a nice one. And then she looked over and she's like, you want one too? And I'm like, sure. Well, I didn't say sure initially. I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. And I'm like, yeah, sure, let's do it. Woo, super excited. And this is excited news too, because a friend of mine in Austria, he worked out a way to hack the XML file and turned this thing into what the RAIN 4 can do. The RAIN 4 can take stems and split it across two channels, acapella, instrumental. Difference is, my friend is much smarter than the guys at Serato, and he made it so you can actually decide which channel you want your acapella and instrumental to be and swap them back and forth. This is really cool stuff, man. He worked hard on it. I'm going to leave links below to his um, PayPal and his social media stuff. If you want in on this stuff, man, give him a shout out and uh, make sure you send him a donation for his time because the guy spent a lot of time doing this stuff. So let me just load up a track here and demonstrate to you what's going on and the way we have uh, this SC Live 4 mapped right now. So decide to use the vinyl button up here because I never use the vinyl button for anything else. And then the Q buttons, you'll watch. Soon I start the track, I'm going to engage this whole system by pressing that. And then I choose which one I want my acapella to be. So let's say I want the acapella over here. And you see up on the screen, how it did it, right? When I'm scared, I found myself Instrumental, acapella I hit that again And watch, back to one track, right? Hit it again And now I want my acapella over here There's my acapella and then, of course, you engage slip. You want to go in deck three, because that's where the acapella is. You can scratch it. I can't scratch. And then, of course, you can engage the effects. Now, what I need to do is I go in here to the effects in Serato. And um, I don't want a low pass. I want to have an epic reverb. So watch this. When you got the vocal going. I can't stop. I still dream about you. So yeah, man, that's it. We don't have to wait for the Rain 4 to come out next year. We've got the technology and the know-how to split those stems on any controller you want. Just so happened we did it on the SC Live 4. If you want to do it on your particular controller, drop links below to tell me what controllers you want. I'm going to have all the information to link up with my buddy. And uh, like I said, you know... Make sure you send him some donation money for his time because this is genius level stuff. He can even customize it. If you want different buttons on your controller, you want a little bit of different stuff, this guy can do it all. You want to be able to do an echo out when you drop the fader? We've done that as well too. Uh, I did the test set. I'm not the brains behind this. I just kind of had the idea because I did it with Virtual DJ. I talked to him and this guy worked his magic. So yeah. Hopefully, uh, this is something you enjoy. Don't, feel free to comment. Make sure you check out his links. Make sure you hook him up. And uh, we don't got to wait for the ring four. Talk to you all soon.